Caveman plus a dinosaur. Caveman loses his whole family. Travels the world. Fights Vikings. Fights a bunch of people. That's all I'm going to say. Phenomenal. It's good. I felt like I, I felt like I was there. <laughs> <laughs> Tom, turn that notifications on so you don't miss an episode. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the Logically Podcast. We have two very important guests coming today. Um, what? Lil Spoon and his uh, manager, Big Big Spoon. Um, <laughs> what's up guys come on the podcast how's it going what's up guys what's up man Damn. thanks for coming thanks for coming how's it going how's it going hey, what's going on so happy to be here what the fuck's good I've been watching you guys for a minute yeah yeah, yeah. yeah man we've just been doing our thing you know yeah welcome man. to Logically Podcast what do you think of the room I uh, it's appreciate small. it small. it's small yeah, it's like you yeah. Didn't all tall you, didn't, you didn't tell us it was <laughs> it, it, you, it's small <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Right, let's get on the interview. Let's go. What's up? So, uh, you know, what have you been up to lately with the music career, man? What, what's your next big thing? Just out here, bro. Just out here. Just spooning. We grinding up out here, oh, man. Okay, we, yeah. We're making big moves, man. <laughs> Ask a better question. Yeah. What so what is what is respectfully? Big, what is big moves entitled to? What is what are you doing? What was your, what was your biggest thing lately? Because I I personally haven't heard of you. Making Yo, all this money. Thank, thankful Yo, oh, for this guy. Wait, You're lucky for this guy. Or I wouldn't have heard of you. I wouldn't have heard of you. Wait a second. Is this like an Andrew Schultz, Nuff Boys interview type shit? You guys don't even know who I am, but you invited me. I had 200 fucking views last month. 200! You guys, you don't know who the fuck I am? Get on it, boys. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Yo. <Welcome> back. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, shit, dude, I'm fucking sweating. Bro, yeah, big time. This is, in here. I feel like a goddamn CEO right now, man. This feels hella good up in here. Look at the way I got my legs crossed with them shoes. What's going on, y'all? Shit, let me. What were you thinking? Let me double check this. Quadruple check at this point. That's me. Uh, check my angle. Do I look good? Do I look good? <laughs> you can do something different my, You can do something different with your face Hey, shit, so what's up boys? Chilling, man The proper, hello, how yeah, you doing, dude? Yeah, you guys look Chilling, fresh man. today, man Appreciate you Shit, all the way from Bangor I think you guys are my the first guest we've had on here That's like live in Bangor Yeah, 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 so, yeah, yeah. That's, We already had a couple of we, ha we already had a discussion about Bangor and stuff yeah. like that But, uh <laughs> So you guys, from from the beginning of the episode, and we had a little discussion, but uh, you guys lived like, what, like 10, 15 minutes away from each other? <laughs> yeah, we, we grew up like 15 <laughs> minutes away from each other, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So how long have you guys been friends, if you don't mind me asking? I don't know, man, like three or four years. Yeah, oh, wow. You were, you were 19, you were 19, you were 18. 18 in three years. So you guys hug years. a lot? Uh, hug? Oh, yeah. He, yeah. Nice. Sometimes. He's a hugger. Oh, yeah, big time. <laughs> yeah, the, he's got a hugger. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. So I'll tell you guys, like, right from the jump, we're going to ask you questions like we don't fucking know you because yeah. that's the, the best. If, if, if we were to just ask questions we didn't know, it's, we're, we're going to miss, like, all the... Like, I'm sweating. <laughs> I'm sweating so bad. I'm sweating so bad right now. So, Fuck. I mean, obviously, like, you guys are both here. We want, for the drive, we wanted to get you guys here at the same time. But we're going to interview you guys separately at the same time. So, fucking, um, so let's start with last release. What was you guys' last release? What do you got coming? Uh, my last release was Rock Out. I uh, just dropped the music video for that. <laughs> just bring that mic a little bit closer to your face, buddy. My last release. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. We're going to do this. It's fragile. It's fragile. Yo, this podcast is ran together with hopes and dreams. <laughs> Let everybody know right now. Where's my monster? MacGyver inspired. Your monster, I threw it out. 
Are you fucking serious? That's no, crazy. of course oh, not. Dude, I was about to cry real tears, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, hold on. I see the real monster. <laughs> Dick away. <laughs> Man, put that beef away. <laughs> so anyway, last release. Like, what'd you got? Rock out. Uh, Fuck yeah. That was with the music video too, right? Yeah, with Edited by Cam. Shout out Edited by Cam. Uh, Shout out. And we also got Gone in the Wind. Yeah. That Dude, was also that was vibe. I was there for that video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Big time. I mean, I didn't, help, I didn't do much, but. <laughs> you took us around. You showed us the places. Yeah. 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 Well, and I like nice. the place with the view. That was huge. Like, I love that shot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. I fucking. I was, dude. Yeah. I was like, I went in. They told me no, so I like found the number of the guy who owns Aura, and I called him and shit. <laughs> fucking. Yeah. No shit. Big time. We didn't get in there though. We, what? You, you thought you had some type of pull? No, no. Actually, you know what's <laughs> Don't funny? make me call I, your boss. You know what's funny? I I pulled the C dot card on that one. I was like, yeah, I know C dot and his manager. <laughs> Fuck it. And they're like, oh. And then all of a sudden, he was like talking to me with respect. Yeah. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, all right, cool. Word, yeah. Pull that more often oh, and shit. Oh, man. <laughs> um, no, but I, that Gone on the Wind song's fire. Sweet, I appreciate that, bro. How did it do on Spotify? It's got it's got a thousand plays right now. A thousand yeah. plays? Yeah. YouTube. I don't even know, honestly. Yeah. It went off on it's YouTube, almost, though. Yeah, it did do good. It went quick. off on yeah. YouTube. Yeah. yeah. Just the visual itself. Yeah. Is fucking. For sure. Like 1.7 right now. 1.7, something like that. Yeah, yeah. People are jumping on it quick, though. Like, yeah. Comments were going crazy. People, yeah. It was a good outcome for what it was, you know what I'm saying? And that so. wasn't. You guys have more songs other than that one? We have Wyvin play with us on his page, yeah, and then uh, we probably some we probably got a bunch in the boat we just haven't dropped yet, yeah, yeah, yeah lots. Like there's just been so many nights, you know. I recorded my crib a lot, so he just he comes I mean, over, shit. we after record him up. So, after yeah. we did uh, Gone in the Wind, we went back and made a song with Moose. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We did like a couple tracks that night. Yeah, yeah. But you guys record with Zebly? We did. Uh, we didn't record of... that track. Well, Zebly mixed that track. Oh, Zebly okay. mixed that track. Yeah. Well, he. He makes my part. Mako makes yours, right? Yeah, Mako makes my yeah, part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Think about that. Yeah, that one we kind of pieced together. I recorded at my crib, sent it out to Zebli, so yeah. What was the person you said name? What Mako. Was... He's got a studio on Bangor. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Do I rec- yeah. What do I recognize a name? What I... Mako. Uh, pa- 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 yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say, I fucking recognize that. That's a spot out there for recording right now. Yeah. Re- that's yeah. what I was going to ask. I yeah. saw someone post this morning uh, asking, I think you guys know him, uh, but he, he posted about... Uh, like looking for a studio at a good price in Bangor or something. Ateus. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's exactly what it was. Yeah, I yeah, couldn't yeah. remember who it was for a second. Yeah, yeah, that's my boy. Yeah, yeah. Shit, dude. Yeah. When are you guys gonna move down here to Portland? Soon, next year or so. Yeah. Really? Are you yeah. really gonna? I want. We want. I mean, I don't know, but if you do, I want to. I'd love you know, to. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I definitely I mean, want to. But. Keep grinding, bro. It's like it's it's amazing how many different fucking ways you're gonna pull in money. Dude. Yeah, what you yeah. you can monetize anything. Yeah, yeah. exactly. For sure. I mean, and obviously, since I've moved back from Florida, and like, cause when I moved before I moved to Florida, I've said this so many times before in other ones. When I moved to Florida, there wasn't much of a scene in Maine for music yeah. or whatever. And I came back. When you move down there? When? Yeah. 2020. 2020. I was only down there like. Yeah. Almost two years, yeah. something like that. But I came back and there was a fucking whole ass scene. Yeah, that's when Bangor started to have the scene because I didn't hear nothing coming yeah. from Bangor. It was we YouTube. had a scene, but there wasn't many like places to perform. There wasn't like yeah. it wasn't like a huge di- yeah. It wasn't much. Of, there is more now. Yeah, like since probably like twenty twenty one, we started doing all kinds of shows okay, at G Force. Yeah. yeah, we started opening up for some bigger people, and yeah, that's when I started seeing the scene in Bangor become more of a thing. Yeah, dude, and like people like go to it. Like yeah, no, people yeah. like go to all the events out there. They and love shit. it. They're good energy. It's like honestly hard to get people out there, but you can really build some, like good relationships there. So. Yeah. yeah, yeah, a lot of people that will really come to support. And just give yeah. Them <laughs> I'm gonna fix something because you're gonna be pissed at yourself if I don't. <laughs> it's right in the middle of your face. <laughs> yeah. well, no, you're doing. <laughs> I was just trying to hide, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I get insecure. Do you sound good? It sounds a little like faded. Yeah. Told you. Yeah, you gotta bring the mic a little bit closer to his face. Well, the good thing is, is when I run into the program too, you won't even notice it. Yeah, but cool. you know, bring it a little bit closer. Yeah, dude, that was great, bro. You're talking, bro, and He's I'm like whispering now. <laughs> I was, no. as, long, <laughs> as long as he talks into the mic, he'd be fine. Yeah, yeah it'll be good. Yeah. Luckily, our program raises vocals, even if it's far and shit, so it'll be good. But dude, I couldn't help it, bro. I just looked over and you're talking. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, bro, what's that look at that Yo. fucking camera? From my yeah. angle, he looks fine. Yeah. So I can't tell because I'm yeah. not seated over there. Yeah. Was, that, um, was that a short thing? 
Yes, because uh, it was like levels in my face. Like, so I'm just like looking at the back of the mic while you're talking. <laughs> so you guys both performed at Jew Force a couple of times? Bunch of times, yeah. yeah Bunch so of times. times yeah. So what other venues is out there right now in Bang- Bangor? I performed at a place called Arts Exchange. That's like in the middle of downtown. Uh, we both opened up. We, we opened up for Chris Webby at a Morgan. Morgan Hill Event Center. Right there. Herman. You opened up for Chris Webby? Yep. Yeah, he opened up. The year I opened up in like 2021, he opened up 2022. Wow, That's dope. Yeah. Yeah. he was just here the other day. He was here. Oh, he was where? at Aura. Oh, where? Yeah. yeah, I didn't even know. He's about got a big it, fan so base out here for sure. Yeah. yeah, people even out in Herman, that place. I think there's like a thousand people probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. packed out. So yeah, Shit. yeah. That's for sure. Crazy. That's dope. For sure. He like he like was very close to selling out the Aura. Those really? There, the how many? Day. How many is that sit? I think what is it? Four hundred fi- downstairs, four, four upstairs. Uh, four fifty downstairs, four hundred upstairs. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, that's yeah. fucking wild. It's pretty good. It's yeah, but he came very close. I'm talking like, yeah. like by like maybe like ten. Really? Yeah. 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 That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. So, so did he, Yeah. Yeah. He uh was with like the oyster guy. I don't know if you know who that is. He's from Portland. He's he's got a pretty good like. Everyone loves him out here. You hear that? Yeah, I haven't heard of him, but yeah. Yeah, it's it's. <laughs> <laughs> He's the. <sighs> if you blame this on me, I swear to God, I'll kill you. Blame what? You know what you did to Tom, our boy. What Tom? When he farted, and you're like, oh, he farted. Oh, dude. <laughs> Yo, so the the kid, the kid's chair made a fucking sound, and it sounded like a fart, and I was dying, dude. I was like, there's no way that wasn't a fucking fart, dude. And, but the, I was like, I'm gonna check the cameras after. I'm gonna make sure, like, I could hear it again. I couldn't hear it. So I edited it in. So you just hear. I, I think fuck. I know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, "You motherfucker, dude!" <laughs> For a whole week, he didn't stop talking about it. It was hilarious. <laughs> he's like, "Bro, I don't know what to tell you, man." Yo, so what's what's uh, obviously with the business out here and it expanding the way it is? Do you guys have like certain marketing plans that you guys like are trying? Like, do you want to like do more music videos? Do you? Like, what is, like, your overall plan? How old are you guys? I'm 21. 23. Good. Uh, yeah, so, so you guys are, you guys are younger, so it's, like, yeah. it's going to take fucking yeah. years. Dude, I still haven't found myself, and I'm almost 28, bro. No, I get it. Yeah, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? Like, just finding your niche and, like, yeah. and shit like that, bro. These celebrities have people do it for them. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And that's what makes it fucking authentic, though. I need to stop saying yeah. fucking. God damn. Yeah. <laughs> freaking. <laughs> I feel like I'll get bullied more if I say freaking. Yeah, dude. for sure. Like, what the hell, dude? Uh, Mo, ask a good question. Um, before I forget, because I will forget the the, the thing. Uh, I heard a song this morning, and it reminded me of you, dude. <laughs> oh, did it? Yeah. So we're gonna play it. Something to do with our love. That's that's sus. One way to play. That's what. <laughs> sure. That's what I'm Are looking. we gonna hold hands? No, we're not gonna. Are you gonna it. peer into my <laughs> eyes deeply? I would prefer if you uh, each other. Yes, for sure. Oh, dog, I can do that all day. Do it. Day. <laughs> Dude, why does he just go with it? <laughs> God damn! Because I'm very comfortable with my sexuality. Like, <laughs> Like what? Like this shit ain't gonna bother me. I had a girl this morning. Yo, bug and some. Dude, I thought of that before and I was like, I thought you were gonna be all confused. Dude, I look over. You guys are just vibing. I told them to vibe and they're like, I don't know how we're not gonna laugh. Yeah. I looked over, expected them to just be laughing, bro. And yeah. fucking, uh, just like. I got all my laughs out before. Yeah. Dude. Oh my. Did you hear the lyrics of that? Yeah. It's, Say one. Yeah. What <laughs> it, it gives me wanted vibes. Um, <laughs> makes me feel warm and fuzzy inside. It makes me want to bust all kinds of nuts. Okay, so he just made it ten times more uh, fucking yeah, sus yeah. than we've been playing. Yeah. Let's bust. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. You ask a question. I'm fucking sweating right now. I know now, you dude. are. You sunburn. Um. <laughs> so obviously, um. You guys both do a lot of collabs. This is something I, I always talk to a lot of the you know local artists mm-hmm. that come on the show. So something I always wanted to do is you guys more willing to expand you guys' horizons and jump on other people's oh. tracks or whatever. Because something that you guys know Kay Dooley, she's talked about, is like people just like raise their price of like their features to the roof. Yeah, I don't and people don't want to work with Yeah, exactly. Yeah. People don't want to work with each other. So you guys are both willing and able to like jump on other people's tracks and yeah. build up you guys' fan base. Yeah, you know? yeah, no, you wanna I mean, expand on that? For me it completely depends on 
how much I like the song, and I think that every, I really think every artist should at least charge a little bit for what they're doing because it yeah. takes time, it takes effort, and like well, at least for the studio time, honed in their craft. Like they take, spend a lot of time writing these lyrics and really working on yeah, doing yeah, the best they can. So if someone wants to charge, I would never ever be like yeah affected by it. I'd be like, of course, like I paid for multiple features. Yeah. The first song I actually ever released, I paid five hundred bucks for. Really? Whoa! Sometimes not even famous at all. Mm. Whoa! Yeah. Holy wow. shit! Wow! How'd the song do? Did you good? Seventy thousand views. Seventy thousand running. Views? It was running. Yeah. That's sex, yeah. dude. That's Hell phenomenal, yeah, man. Yeah. Hell yeah! yeah. Shit. You will, dude. It's, yeah. it's all about the fucking grind. Fucking stay and, consistent. And, you just gotta. And with the collaborating thing, like you asked, that was a good. That was a good question. Um. Then you said that you don't get that. The whole, like, charging thing. I mean, I've had people with, like, way less followers than me be like, yeah, it's just $200. And it's like, you know, I'm not going to ever disrespect them for doing yeah. that. But in my head, I'm like, well, that's not benefiting me in any way. Mm-hmm. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Like, exactly. I have mm-hmm. more followers than you, so it's kind of like something yeah. like that. But it's no, like, disrespect or nothing. It's just like, but I'm always willing to work. Like, I don't care who it is. Like, if you want to make a track, I'm like, yeah, come through. Let's yeah, and if song. you're vibing like, with yeah. it, you're vibing, wow. with it. vibing with it. It may not go out. I mean, like, yeah. just make the song. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. And yeah. then with the with what you said, too, about the, uh, like, taking time to do it, too. At least, like, the studio time. That, that makes a lot of sense for some things. Um but obviously, like what you said, if they're smaller following and it's not benefiting yeah, you too, I just don't understand. I would pay like if someone like is doing like like C dot someone I pay for hundred percent. Yeah, earns every dollar you give them like that. Like that's someone you pay for. But I'm not saying like just somebody that's not really posting much music. That, that's not somebody you want to yeah. pay for. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so no, I fucking get that. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I mean, it's just dog. I say it all the time. It's dog eat dog world, bro. It's like everybody, as much as we don't want to say it, everybody uses each other. Yeah. You know what I mean? I wouldn't go as using each other. It's it's called uh, uh, cross uh, pollination, right? You, you know, like, let me get a little bit of rub off you guys. You guys get a little bit of rub off me and let's, you know, let's grow together. You know, obviously, you guys see me. I'm always preaching. Let's help each other out, right? We're all from the same goddamn state. Why do we always got to be against each other? You nerd. But, you know, (laughs) (laughs) you love how I took that nice beautiful thing and I just ruined it I was like I'm gonna play play that song again one more time (laughs) yeah um, so you know I love exactly what you said you know Mm -hmm. you don't care too much about the the money part you just want to work with people you know let's just just do it right and let's just say that song goes viral goes number one Hey, we you guys were both eating. making yeah, lots of money. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. But you at the same time, I, I get where you're coming from too. Sometimes like, hey man, I got bills to pay. Yeah, yeah, I got yeah. studio time I got to pay for. Well, no, he said to me, remember, he's, he's like, I'll tell people $100 just to see if they're serious. And then if they that's say nice. yes, that's I won't charge. That's a solid them. point. That's, that's a good, so yeah. like, that's like, that's like, respect. Gordo, I like that. Gordo paid me for a feature and I respected him so much more since. I know he takes it seriously now. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. he takes yeah. it seriously. So. Yeah. Well, that's actually, that's like. Shout out. <laughs> Shout out! Hey, that's that song dropping. I don't know, man. We got other stuff to go. I haven't put another song in for a while. Yeah. You're gonna have to drop it. Yeah. <laughs> I have a lot of music to drop right now. I got lazy there for a second. You guys got a bunch in the vault, like so vault? much. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Dude, wow. I've been such a month to month guy with my music, bro. Yeah. I should spend month to month, but I wait for nine months and just put something out. Yeah. Yeah. My that's smart and, though. Yeah. It, yeah. It, it does help me out because then I, where I don't have to like be forced to have like spend my money to. It's so smart. You're just so yeah. ready to like have yeah. 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 Well. We'll talk about this later, Mom. <laughs> what I was gonna say was, uh, I'm sorry to interrupt you. Um, Thank you. What I was gonna say was, <laughs> you you built up a vault. You know, you can always put out like um, obviously we got to be on top of a social media game, right? Yeah, hundred percent. So you can always yeah. just put up a little like little teasers here and there. You know, what I'm mm-hmm. saying, hey, soon coming out soon. What do you guys think about this? Right? Yeah. Keep your people engaged yeah. while you're still building up that you know that portfolio of music yeah. that you have in the in the vault, and then. Don't ever be afraid of, oh, shit, am I going to run out? You're never going to run out, you know? You guys are artistic people, right? You guys will always be, like, walking down the street, for example, and you're going you're gonna to be like, man, I, I got this tune in my head, and I just got these lyrics going through my head. With him, he does the same thing all the time, and you can go into the studio, just grab your pen or, you know, on your yeah. phone and start writing. You will never run out of ideas. Mm. That's one thing that I've, I've, I've learned from artists. You guys it's, will never run out of ideas. It's a creative mindset. Yeah. It's like, a, do you guys have ADHD? Yeah. Because I do. If you have ADHD, do you have ADHD? 
So that's why we're so fucking creative and shit. And then Mo's a businessman. Mo, yeah. Mo's the business guy over yeah. here. <laughs> <laughs> fucking. Yeah. Money. Yeah, yeah. That's all I think yeah. about. Money. Yeah. No, it's, I've always been a strong believer. If you got ADHD, dude, you have a fucking creative yeah. ass mind. And you yeah. can either choose to use it to create with it or fucking, you know what I mean? So what, be destructive? Swear it. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, dude, it's... I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll yeah. Go back to what you're saying. It's too late now. You over. You over ruined it. <laughs> um, I want to talk about you guys' uh, childhood growing up. Um, so give me the rundown on that. When did music started impacting your life? Music. Oh, that was kind of late for me. Honestly, I was like 15 or 16, and what it was is like I'd never really been to a concert, let alone a rap one. My boy, he was like. Yo, let's go to this Wiz Khalifa concert. It's when uh, Wiz and Snoop are going on tour. They came to uh, you talking about, Mass. You talking about no, no, don't. Mac they Miller? came in Bangor too. Did they? Yeah. Man, Wait, I mean, you talking about Mac Miller came? No, no, no. This was like, this was a Snoop Dogg Wiz. Uh, I can't even remember. 2014. What name was. It's crazy too because you were there and this before I knew you. I literally remember seeing you because I loved your music at that time yeah. too. But, anyways, like. Yeah, it was uh, Mansfield Mass. It was Snoop Dogg. Kevin, Kevin Gates opened up. Jen oh. Aika oh, opened dope. up. But it was that's crazy because, like, Wiz Khalifa was always my favorite artist. Like, big yeah. time. I love Wiz Khalifa. Like, yeah, my man. Like, he's fire. Like, yeah, so, like, I went there, and, like, I wasn't ever thinking about doing music at this time. Like, this is part of my freshman year at high school. And I went there, and then I saw Kevin Gates perform. And that's when I was like, yo, I want to do this, bro. Brings like, that energy. Yeah, literally. Yeah. Like, not even, like, he just was, like, sitting up on the stage, like, and he didn't move much. But he, you know how you guys listen to Kevin Gates at all? Yeah. Like, he just real lyrical. Like, he really, like, you really listen to him when he did. Yeah. And he was just standing up on stage. And I was like, yo, I want to do this shit. Like, mm -hmm. And then, like, probably, like, a couple months, like, I can't tell you so long ago now. But, yeah, like, me and my boys that don't make music at all, they're like, yo, like, you know, we live in a small town, ain't much to do. So, like, we, uh, we're like, let's, let's, let's freestyle, we'll, we'll roast each other. So, we start, like, kicking it. They start roasting each other and stuff. Yeah. And then, like, all of a sudden, I go in, I had, like, this little flow. And they were like, yo! yeah. And yeah. that was like, yo, I'm doing this. I'm pretty sure from that day on, I've done music, like, every day. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. So, I didn't know that. Yeah, I mean, I haven't told many people that. But, like, yeah, that's, like, been, that was, like, a huge inspiration for me. But it was just, like, this feeling you get. And it was, like, yeah. this, like, uh, this this uh uh ecstasy almost yeah kind of but not like uh an outlet like i just mm. like you know i had a lot going on at that time in my life and it was just a place i could go and like literally just be in my own head you know yeah what I mean? yeah so, oh, exactly yeah. so like that was like a huge like that's that's when music came in i'd say seriously pushing music only like three years ago yeah you know like really taking the time to invest in myself go to actual studios like we start that's when we start going to kurt that's when i really started taking it serious because before i'm just like doing garage band and like mm. just releasing shit on soundcloud but now yeah. like you know I, I was like me and my boy phaser one night we're like yo like i'm sick of this shit i want to like i want to go crazier he's like he's like so we talked to this guy named d the flyest out in boston and he was like <clears throat> come to the studio phoenix down studio like a lot of people like snoop dogs recorded there yeah uh Millie's uh, a lot of big, a lot no of big shit. names been through yeah. there, and we were like, "Word!" So that's when we met our boy, uh, our boy Kurt Beaton, and he yeah. he started. You know, we started going there a lot, a lot, and then like we started getting more comfortable in a real studio, and like you know, like having like to actually have a good like feedback of what the song's gonna sound like. Yeah, like, huge, like but well, super yeah. huge. Dude. And then it's then we started dropping. I started dropping on like all platforms more consistently than I was like, you know, you learn as you go. I'm still learning. So yeah. like, that's where I'm at now. Yeah. Dude, hell yeah. Yeah, for you, sure. You told me recently that when you sent me the uh, last song that you put out and you said, I'm still trying to find my sound. I was like, bro, you fucking, you found that shit, Yeah, dude. I appreciate Both that. Both of you. Yeah. Hey, dude, you know what's, uh, I gotta ask you guys, because you said you called yourself a rapper a minute ago. Did I? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not I don't really consider myself Yeah, you're not I was going to say When I started making music though, I was on that boom bap shit. Like every was, everybody was, is, dude. I was really like rapping. Yeah, like, everybody is. You know, really, I, will I remember say, like being like I'm bringing the old school music back. Yeah, like that yeah. was my whole thing like me and my boy <laughs> CJ, yeah. C different CJ, but yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> taller CJ. He yeah. is taller. He's like six four. <laughs> six four? He's like six four. Oh, wait to just come over here yeah. and make fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. the tall, he's five the tall six. CJ. Yeah. About six on a damn good day, bro. Yeah. Um, one thing I will say about you guys too <laughs> is you guys have like a natural, like on tone voice when it comes to like singing and fucking mm -hmm. cause it's like you guys. Like you, you have rap songs, and you also have a lot of singing songs. Boy can rap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, yeah. You're, you're, uh, 
your pops makes music too or something. Yeah, I, yeah, saw, yeah. Him actually. Yeah, I saw yeah. that. At some point, I need to drop that. I don't you haven't dropped it yet? I don't know when I'm going to. So I don't know if I want to save it until... Does it go hard as fuck? It's crazy. What what, what genre is it? Because you, you said something about country. Is it country or no. something? Like no. His, his dad wrote rock voice. Like, it's like crazy. Rock, yeah, like, kind of. Oh, like, hell yeah. It sounds like Journey mixed with a train horn. You know that song? Oh, that's a, that's oh, it's so funny how that I song love got created, Journey. though. Like the dress song got created, like the dog. Remember, you're like what? Oh, yeah. his dad. His the dad's like, yo, I need a, I need a girl's name right now to like make this song about because it's called Sweet Sadie or something. Yeah. And uh, my girl goes, Sadie, get over here to the dog, and he goes, Sadie, <laughs> that's it. And he, st- he made the he made the hook about Sweet Sweet Sadie, and it's so funny, bro. But it's so fire, like so fire. Sweet, sweet Sadie. Yeah. They just pulled up at like eight o'clock at night. Yeah, yep. Go all the way to Bangalore just to record me. Yeah. No shit, wow. dude. He yeah, loved it. Too. Yeah. Wait, wait, go back to the country music thing. Though. So far. Yeah. You made country. So far. You made, what? Where is this? I have a lot. The vault, man. The Actually, vault. you know what's funny? I've been pretending that I didn't know about this. I already tried to find it, and I couldn't find it. So you're going to <laughs> have to show me. It's great, Because no one makes country fucking music, so I wanted to see, like, what the vibes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah because... Our our cameras are our phones, so we can't look it up. <laughs> he plays that song again. The he people on <laughs> <my booty take. laughs> so actually cam. <laughs> Country cam. Bruh. Where's this at? The vault. <laughs> Isn't the vault? The vault's deep, dude. Wow. Bro, Bro, fucking send me that, dude. Yeah. I'll, that's I'll buy that. That's Yo, his other phenomenal. country one's fire, too. Yeah. Yeah. Have you made a country song? No, 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 no. Oh, you gotta try. I, I would want to. I would do it. Yeah, I used yeah. to get hammered and make country Dude, songs. Dude, I'd do it for sure. Yeah, yeah. It'd yeah. always be about like John Deere trucks and shit. <laughs> I don't got no John Deere trucks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Yeah. Uh, I'll bleep it. It's. it's Don't fucking leak this. <laughs> He's like, that's going on the Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> CJ Harry's number. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. That's amazing, man. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Very multi talented. I, I love all music, man. My mom had me growing up on old school rap and pop. And Your mom listened to rap? Yeah. I was Hell yeah. A song today. Can you show me My this? mom put me. Some hood shit. Really? <laughs> like, really? Yeah. No way. Yeah. Dude. He's like, yo, my mom put me onto this. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm like, your mom wow. did? Yo, it's crazy. It's a good song. Yeah, <laughs> I like it. Wow. Yeah. Did like, she did she listen to like the drill rap now or? No, I bet she would if I. I bet if I showed yeah. one, I bet she'd be like, yes. who did she wow. listen to? That Ooh. guy's name was Jaw S L T, but uh, she listens to everything, man. She yeah. uh, she's a big Salt and Pepper fan. Uh, Black Sheep. Yep. Uh, Crazy, bro. How about MF Doom? Any of that kind of stuff right I there? I listen to MF Doom. I listen to a little bit. I listen to literally, literally everything. Mm. Like, I'm the same way, too. Everything. Yeah. I you know what I'm playing guitar at like four years old. And Whoa. Same. I uh, played piano when I was in seventh grade. I don't know how old I was right now. You guys do yeah. school band? No, I didn't. I wish I did. You guys didn't do yeah. it? No. I did Gifted and Talented, which was like. I had like a class every day where I'd go and I'd get to be taught guitar or piano. Really? Yeah, I'd have to like That's sick. Like, I feel like my school had something wow. like that too. Yeah, we didn't. Yeah. Give uh, it. it was wild because Bucksport wasn't like the most amazing school system. So I was like, yeah. fuck yeah. Get to <laughs> That's dope. <laughs> <laughs> I got family up in Bucksport. I've only been up there like twice, so. Yeah. That's crazy. What about, what about your What about your family? What did you grow up on? Like what was the vibes? Music? Yeah. Ugh. It's kind of like my dad had me on a bunch of stuff when I was real young. And then like, honestly, like my, my, both of my parents are just music. Like they just like music. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Music was always just played and stuff. But like, I can't really like, like literally just so much music. Like my dad's the type of dude where he'll, he'll listen to Tupac and then he'll literally change the next song to country song. And then he'll, yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Versatile. So, yeah. Yeah. He listened to a lot, yeah. of, a lot of stuff. But uh, Brian McKnight. Uh, that was his favorite, favorite artist growing up. Like, Who's that? Uh, well, I don't know. You don't know Brian? Should I know that? Yeah. Oh, 
Oh yeah. shit! Uh, shit! You still don't know? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, dude, no. I recognize. I recognize it now. I recognize it yeah, yeah, yeah. now. Just the name. Get him in the comments. I'm sorry. I, <laughs> <laughs> music like fuck that. Is back yeah. off. <laughs> uh, you know what I grew up fucking on, what? listening to in the car, driving with my mom's. <laughs> you know the fucking old Eminem? musical hairspray. <laughs> musical. <laughs> 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 my mom used to, dude. My mom used to be playing the corniest songs, and this was her dance move in the car. She just, <laughs> she just <laughs> sat there like this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This my dad's dance move on stage. Nah, he does the. He holds the mic in hand and just goes. <laughs> yeah, that, <he> just, <laughs> that's amazing, yeah. dude. I got him in a vlog. He's like, I don't know what to do without a guitar in my hand. Yeah. Like, <laughs> 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 yeah, just like sitting there like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's fucking amazing, bro. Yeah, shit. What what was you? What you grew up on? Me, I grew up on everything. Yeah, everything. I even like listen to like Japanese music. That's crazy. Like, yeah, I a bit. yeah Japanese. Anime, so. Oh, me too, mom. <laughs> I'm the only one who has. Uh, yeah, I can't I get into you this are you can't do it. boring, dude. I don't know what to tell you, bro. I don't know. Animes. My well, Hero the, Academia. It's either you love it or you just don't get into it. I feel you know what yeah. I mean. Dude, no, anime is so good. They make my it... brother ran out of anime to watch. This is what we do: watch anime together. We hang out. Yeah, we, we, anime is so good, man. We watched a, a volleyball anime, and it was so hype. Oh it my god! So <laughs> <hype>. <laughs> <laughs> what? Have you seen the basketball? Like <laughs> Have you seen the basketball one? Yeah, I can get into. Oh, you didn't like that one? Yeah, oh. I watched the volleyball one. God. I'm so oh. fucking confused right now. What are they talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, my all time favorite top Naruto. Naruto? Bleach. Okay. Right? Not Shupiden was good, yep. but the Naruto. OG Naruto, yeah. OG Naruto was just good. Uh Toonami. Uh psh, hell yeah, dog. Uh Dragon Ball Z. Of course. I still watch it, you know, when they put it out. Um One Piece. Mm -hmm. Phenomenal. Of course. Gundam Wing. Oh. You're into it too, aren't you? I hear you going oh, yeah. mm, in the background. Every time you said one, I just hear him go. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's what I grew up on, dog. Mm. It's like, goddamn, speak. Yeah. But now it's like, now it's like my hero, though. You know, yeah. everybody's everybody's into my hero. But I also love like Trigun. I love like the old Is anime, the new, one the new Trigun. Yeah. I haven't watched it. Oh nah, man, I grew you up on Family Guy. I didn't bro. even watch the Cowboy Bebop yeah, like remake. Park and all that. I'm like, nah, yeah. I'm good. I know the OG. I like the OG. Everybody hates Chris. That was my favorite growing up. Yeah. 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 Did you guys watch Family Absolute Matters and shit back in the day? You guys are a lot younger than me, so maybe not. What was it? What was it? Family Matters. There was Family Matters. Oh, I've heard of it. I don't know if I have I don't watched it. What it is, but I remember watching. It. Yeah. 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 yeah, the sitcom style yeah. shit, dude. Yeah. I watched that. I watched it. You're 30? Yeah, so you remember like Family Matters, yeah, obviously, yeah, yeah. all that shit. Who okay. was in Family Matters? The real Nick at Night. They play SpongeBob on Nick at Night. Did they really? The old Nick at Night back <laughs> in the day was <laughs> fire. Yeah. Some of that stuff was wild, dude. I remember like, uh, I remember some crazy cartoons back in the day. Like, they could haunt me. What was that? What was that one? Happy Rocky Tree Friends. Uh, Running Stimpy? Running Stimpy. Like, uh, How about Rocco's World or whatever? Rocco's World. Yeah, Happy, that Happy guy Happy Tree was Friends? Crazy. Have you seen that? I've seen it. I couldn't get through much of it. Dude, I can't either, bro. It's it's like a bunch of these like little animals, this cartoon, and they're all like happy, like, hey, like all animated, and then they just start ripping each other's fucking Stabbing dicks off. Whoa, 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 yeah. whoa, whoa. <laughs> Yo, you know what to... I, I don't know. I, I remember... It was, okay, I think, yeah. Crazy. Yo, <laughs> Dude, if fun. you like anime and stuff like that, right, uh, there's a the show. It's called Primal, right? There's not a lot of talking. Beautiful animation, right? You should get into that. Where's it at? I just find it online. Oh, yeah, I, I, primal. It's, it's called Primal, <laughs> and and I'm, and primal. Primal. <laughs> I, I'm not. It's, it's called Primal. I like. I found it like just perusing through Facebook or whatever one time, and then it popped up, and then I was like, oh, I can't stop watching this. Oh man, it's phenomenal. It just finally ended. Phenomenal. Not a lot of talking. It's great. <laughs> oh my god It's brutal too it. It's good I think I've heard of that Is that what they're like Almost like Transformer looking things Or something Man look into the camera And say that <laughs> <laughs> I can't know. No Do you want me to give you A little rundown Alright 
Uh, I'm gonna give it a run. Well, give it a run last down. time you gave a rundown of the last episode, yeah. I, I edited it yeah. and it was six minutes long about Steve, Stone <laughs> Cold <laughs> Steve Austin. Stone Cold. <laughs> by the way, that Stone Cold Steve Austin documentary was life. What are you talking about? <laughs> was life. People loved it. Um, caveman plus a dinosaur. Caveman loses his whole family. Travels the world. Fights Vikings. Fights a bunch of people. That's all I'm gonna say. Phenomenal. It's good. I felt like I, I felt like I was there. Oh, that when when you see his family get done done up like that. Oh man, brutal. That was amazing. That was fun. Dude. Hey, you know one thing I noticed about you. What? When you don't like something, you try to ruin it. No, okay. You ruin it for <laughs> everybody. You ruin it all the time. I, said I don't ruin anything. You're like, no one cares. This isn't about you. I'm because like, you're another... boring. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. <laughs> what happened? I just kicked off the mic. Oh. I'm not used to this area. I feel like a CEO. What? Yeah. Air Force is all I wear. He tried to hide them. <laughs> um. I, I hope refuse. I'm doing a good job of bouncing back and forth between you guys. I'm trying real hard to basketball. do it. Yeah, like basketball, which I would never make any team that if I ever tried out for. But <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> Fuck! Now I'm gonna have to make an edit of that shit. <laughs> uh, you have a show coming up. Are you on that show too? Summer Sound? No, but Summer. I might come on his set. Yeah, yeah. yeah. dude. Yeah. Dude, you have to do you Gone in the to. Wind, bro. That's, That's such. Yeah. I, I showed my girlfriend that, and she fucking. Uh, she uh, usually I'm pretty private about that. It's the first time I said that on the show, actually. I can't believe you said that. <laughs> um, but I showed her that, and she fucking downloaded it. She fucks with that song. That's lit. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's dope ass song. No, <laughs> back the fuck up. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> it's like this is why I don't bring her up on the show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, never. <laughs> it's like that shit now. <laughs> What a monster! <laughs> playing, Goddamn playing. monster! I'm playing. I'm playing. Um, no, but when is Summer Sound? August 11th. August right. 11th. Acton Fairgrounds. Never been, but I'm excited. Acton. Is it last? Is it in Maine? Yeah, Acton. Acton. A C T O S. Isn't it? it? Yeah, it's like on the other side of Sanford or something, right? It's on the other side of Sanford. I've got cat hair in my mouth. God damn. Acton. Yeah, it's the six for sure. It's, yeah, yeah, it's the booty. I think it's on the other side of Sanford, right? Does anybody know? <laughs> That's awesome. We don't usually have someone with like a, a, a phone. A phone. Oh, this is amazing. Yeah. This is good, dude. Really we, we, yeah. Oh, man. Looking stuff up, I would yeah. love for that. Yeah, that'd be tough. That would be nice. Give him his own little mic. Yeah. 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 And he can have the, the headphones on. And he can just, you know, tell us about yeah. Sancho. <laughs> <laughs> That's what kind of what we're trying to, we're trying to, as like, there's like, a little bit of money coming in as it gets more and more. We're gonna hire people and fucking. We're about to upgrade to 4K, which we talked about last night. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which is dope. That's I mean, our phones say it's filming in 4K, but it's. Mm-hmm. Just, I thought it was already 4K. It looks great. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, someone gonna say something about that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, see, everyone says that, but I I see it. Maybe it's because I edit it, but no, fucking. it's because you're deep in your own. Subconscious sometimes. Oh yeah, hundred percent it is. Me and you had a moment the other night. It was phenomenal. What? Which one? You talking about? Where me and you had like a like conversation. And you talking about the argument, almost argument. We didn't. That's nothing. But yeah. No. After. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. No real shit. Yeah. Told you. So it's so, a wait. I it's not know. near. I know. Where it was. <laughs> it's like wait. When did you? No, start? but <laughs> actually, I actually kind of knew where it was because it's next to Sugarloaf. What? Farmington's next to Sugarloaf. Is it Sugarloaf far away? Nope. It's two and a half hours. Wait, I've been what? That's Wait. <laughs> oh, for real? Yeah. Wait. It's like right on the border of like New Hampshire. So what do you think? Damn, like 45 minutes from here? No, wait. It's, it's an hour. Hour? hour? It's probably like three or four. Dude, for real. <laughs> Dude. That's one thing. Like you guys live in Bangor, which is kind of like. Up there. Just far away from everywhere. Yeah, man. damn. It's like in the center of Maine, though. Not that I would ever go. North. Yeah, if yeah. you go above that, dude, it's it's a, it's literally trees. Yeah. 
trees. Yeah. No exits. Dude, there's a really? bunch of there's a bunch of like <laughs> Amish towns up yeah. north. Yeah. And it's like it's wild, dude. People are riding around on horses and shit. Yeah. It's like not even Maine, dude. Right. It's well, like, there's it's, no more street signs. It's just numbers. Yeah. And letters. No, it's yeah. Fucking, it's fucking wild. Wild. Dude. Shit. How, Past Presque Isle. Back to the music, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So the show that's dope. that's the second show they're doing for Summer Sound, right? I think so yeah, I'm not 100 like, all that song. Yeah, I, don't really, I know uh, Magnus, he plays Nashville. Yeah, she's running it, right? Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. So such a vibe too, man. I'm I'm excited to see it. See dot's gonna be there. Nobody's gonna be there, huh? Are you performing? I might do. I wasn't gonna say anything, but I might. I might do a song with nobody on his oh, set yeah, or yeah, something yeah. like that. But yeah. I wasn't booked on it or anything. Mm-hmm. I'm not tall enough <laughs> or nothing like that. It was. Hey, nobody is not short compared to me, dude. Is he taller than you, dude? Everyone's short to you guys. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. How tall are you guys, by the way? I'm probably like six three. He's probably like six six five. How tall are you? Six. Six one. Six one. How tall are you? Hey. You're doing better than me. That's average. That's no, the average. average. The average height in the United States. I looked it up. I act. I looked it up. I looked up the average height in the United States. Five nine. No way. It's the average height. You know. You know accurate, what is yeah. that? You know what's uh, the average people height over six feet? Men, seventeen percent. Really? Yeah. The only reason why I'm is because I saw state, some girls. Bro. I saw some girls tweet, and she goes, "Anybody under five eleven should end themselves." <laughs> Damn, <laughs> bro, <That's> freaking <laughs> wild! <laughs> oh, if I said that to him yesterday, he would have jumped off that freaking window. <laughs> it was brutal. I see bro. it all the time. Oh my! Is that God. getting cold? Is that getting cold on you? No, nah, just. Oh man Shit dude No I'd just float If I jumped out that shit dude. I'd just float away <laughs> um, Well uh, Back to the show stuff Rest in peace G-Force Yeah Is that shit Ooh. That was a big We should talk about us. We should talk about that Yeah We should, we should talk we about should that We should talk about that I, I had that show With c that got cancelled up there <laughs> Huh <laughs> Dude Dude, rest yeah. in peace, G Force, bro. Uh, bring that mic a little bit close to yourself, my friend. Oh, <gasps> he broke our no, stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to upgrade. It's time to we upgrade. <laughs> Might have to upgrade here. So, soon. so we obviously we we're off air and we spoke about yeah. it, but uh, are we on G Force? We're talking about G Force. Yeah, G Force. Okay, all right. Talk about G Force. I'm ready. Is that okay? Yeah, I'm ready. I know. I know you had a traumatic experience. Yeah, it was very traumatic. I was I know. pretty upset about that. Yeah, that's okay. crazy. So, <laughs> you guys both performed there, right? Yeah. It's actually but, yeah. a, a good place for a lot of it was up the and spot. coming, it was the, yeah, you yeah, know, the solid spot. acts. You know, I mean, up, he was bringing in big artists, having us open for them. Like, we yeah. opened up for Fetty Wap, Stunner for Vegas, uh, Scory. Um, you guys yeah. opened for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, but there's a couple more, too, probably. But, They're working on Bobby Shmurda, too. Yeah. They're yeah, working yeah. on Bobby Shmurda. Yeah. So... What happened? It was oh, okay. be as vague as possible if you guys want, yeah. or if you need to, be. if you need to be, uh, or if you want us to, we can we can bleep. It I mean, out. I know what's going yeah. on. I know. Yeah. I mean, we, yeah, we all do. But so what happened was they didn't have either a state or city liquor license or like entertainment license. There's like two of them. They had one of them, but not the other. Yeah. So they were hosting all these shows and doing all this stuff, and apparently it was not okay. And Bangor came and found out. It was the city that was the problem, right? Yeah. It was the city that city tried to... They didn't have a city permit. Mm. Yeah. Why? They had a state permit. Why? That's wild. Yeah. yeah. So, since there was already things going on down there, like shootings, and there was other complaints and other things that happened there that were yeah. not so great, um, Bangor kind of set a target on them, I think, in my opinion. But 100%. Yeah. Went in and uh, tried to just shut down the business, make sure they're not doing what they're not supposed to be. But then eventually Brian got his uh, entertainment license. Yeah. By that point, he'd already canceled their biggest concert of the year, which was for, um, I'm trying to remember who it was. Winger, I think, Kip Winger. That was one of the biggest concerts at that time. And yeah. So I'll give all the tickets back. And mm, that's crazy. Because there were police coming in and telling them that people couldn't dance. They weren't allowed to dance to the music. They could Are you serious? Dance. No, no dance. What? Yeah. <laughs> but it just that's seems. Actually it sounds like the city was literally just harassing the fuck. Yeah. But yeah. the city's also making money. Yeah. 
Yeah, but the city is bringing people in. It yeah, sounds like, like they're control laps. freaks. Yeah, like the yeah. which is crazy, bro. Yeah, well, but it's understandable because every time the rap scene's involved, like there's something there's crazy clubs. goes. Some shit happens. Yeah. G-force, just concerts. I guess you said it's a nightclub, but there's concerts. Yeah. 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 Well, the shootings. They obviously should be concerned about it, but at the same time. Yeah, well, that's how it always does. Like they use rap lyrics to yeah. put, like to in court. Now, nah, well, they try to. Yeah. Think they can. No, I think they will. They, they try. Are. Yeah, no. Re- yeah, yeah. No, in uh, in Houston, that's what they're doing. In Atlanta, yo, same yo, thing. That's yo, what they're yo, doing. What? I hate your cat, man. <laughs> I hate your cat. <laughs> that boy. <laughs> <laughs> yo. He's like, I'm, I'm, I'm out. out. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> yo, what? He just comes under like that all the time. <laughs> yeah. It's just like he comes in here thinking it's a normal squad. Like, who the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> who the hell is all this? <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, I know. you see her do the little walk back <laughs> and then just walk. Back. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is? Because I, I'm not sitting there. <laughs> if I'm sitting there, then she'll probably come in. Yeah, well, yeah. it's well. There's also a lot of people in here that she doesn't recognize. She doesn't recognize. Yeah, yeah. I'm happy you guys got to witness that. <laughs> I wish we had a camera <laughs> showing yeah. her just a slide back. <laughs> <laughs> that was so All right, so now G Force is RIP. <coughs> so what is the other venue that you guys are going to be performing at now? So is there another? That's my manager. He's working on a lot of that right now. All oh, right. Yeah. And, yeah. That's plus I go. You yeah. guys, yeah, you guys did a show there recently, right? which is like a weird spot, but it's dope. Like it's like an antique shop. Yeah, like, out back there's a stage, it's and it's like, like a speakeasy, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's cool as fuck though. It's different, but like, and they got like a little backstage area and stuff. How far is it from G Force area? Five ten minutes. Yeah, really? Because it's a brewer, so brewers like the the Twin City, like the other side. Oh uh, yeah, of the, true. Of the water, yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, other than that, I mean. Look, I think we're looking at like arts exchange because I've been there before, but they're really like you got to sell this shit out. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So like that would take a couple just to like really promote it, a couple months, maybe a year. Who knows what that is? And then yeah, like, we're also working on the same place we opened up for Webby, but same shit there. You know, you got to really get get a crowd there. So we're working on all that. And then, I mean, is there any place else other than the Spot and Brewer? I mean, I mean, like, I guess if you're lucky or not lucky, but if you get a connection, you could probably go perform at Pratt's. <laughs> I don't yeah. know where else. Yeah. Stuff like that. So, well, hopefully they get on that soon because the G Four shit was just wild. Yeah, that, that's what was making the scene. That's what helped me. I'm like, I'm really an antisocial person. I completely grown Thanks. myself completely in the past two years. Yeah, yeah. like performing has been like the main thing. That's like that's my favorite thing in the world. Yeah, which is mm-hmm. crazy. More yeah, like, yeah. It took me a while to get used to performing. Yeah, I heard you used to be shy. I'm still am like still yeah, shy. Yeah, my, my voice was all shaky at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, yeah. I noticed that, bro. Yeah, I yeah. noticed that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. That's the thing is it's it's one of those things where once you start doing it like yeah. with anything performing fucking yeah. anything it's like once you start doing it and then Just you get used to it, yeah. you get used to it like it's like on for say when you guys perform or whatever I'm sure the first two minutes you're if you're not drunk or something you know what I mean yeah. you, you have the nerves <laughs> still yeah really I fell right off the stage right as soon as you walked yeah. out the one you yeah. fell off the stage yeah, I walked right out and just Straight down. I is there a video of this? I, I, there might be I was this in front of everyone? Yeah. It was my 21st birthday. I, got I fell on your set during Why I Haven't Played With Us. Yeah, we both fell. I had to <laughs> there was like, <laughs> there was awesome, like a, and like, this is like, uh, there's like a step and like, it was like a two step to get on the stage and like, I missed the last step and I just like, just ate it, fell into somebody. I was like, my bad, bro. And then hopped back up <laughs> bro, on stage. That is amazing. <laughs> and there's no videos? Uh, I hope someone has. Shit, I, I think Damien does. You guys figure it out because I would love to put it on the show. If not, I'm going to just find yeah. some random video on YouTube and just that pretend it was y'all. That was birthday, too, so we was a little, yeah. That was yeah. at the show. B Phrase bought me a bottle of tequila. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that'll fucking do it. Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I did. That's that's awesome, bro. That's my biggest fear is falling on stage. Yeah, I don't know if I've ever done it. I think I've honestly done it twice. Like if I'm being honest, really, yeah, like it's been a thing. Like, the cords at G Force. The cords at G Force. That's what it was. I didn't really like fall. I just like trip real quick, but save myself. Well, yeah. I will say it, it sucks performing when you don't have a cordless mic. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. especially really when there's two hard. of you. I mean, like we we're wrapping up each other. In that's the what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what I'm it's saying. Funny though, because I'll be tripping and shit, and I'll just like recover and I'll laugh and. Yeah. Like, ah. yeah, dude, it's fucking. I don't know, bro. Well, you guys should get some shows going down here, then. That's what I'm, I want to do. That, yeah, yeah. 
for sure. I think the scene's a little bit harder out here. People yeah. are a little bit more haters in the Portland area. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of haters, though, I feel like, where we at. Like, haters yeah. everywhere. It, it's it, definitely everywhere. Hey, yeah. There's never been a hater who's doing better than you. That's facts. <laughs> it's always the truth. Yeah. So, what's the, obviously, you guys said the next step is coming down Portland. Yeah. It's moving down here. Yeah. Um, But what is your, give me a couple months ago. Six months ago, in a year ago, from All both right. of you guys. I want to know what you guys got So, planned. right now, I'm just trying to stay steady, like, short-term with my drops. Like, I've been mm-hmm. trying this every three-week thing. And I've done it the last, like, four or five songs. It's been, like, starting with Gone on the Wind, I've dropped pretty consistently. Once yeah, I a saw month. that. Yeah, so, like, um, pretty much staying consistent. Meanwhile, I'm working on, like, a, a, an EP and stuff. And, like, I'm not, like, going to say too much more about it. But, like, I'm just working right now on that. So that's probably, like, six-month goal would be, like, the EP. Hell, yeah. Really get that, like, I want, I want to come out different. I want to come out with, like, merch for it. I want to come out with just everything ready, like. Full-on project. Yeah, full yeah. promotion plan. I'm learning, like, where to put my money right now. So, like, that's what I'm really, like, six months. And, like, up to that, I'm building for that year. I mean, like, I just want to get, like, once I get more established with that EP and like certain things, like I really want to start doing shows, you know, pushing and then pushing like an album or something mm-hmm. like in the f- in near future. But yeah, that's it right now. I'm just really trying to learn still. Just trying to like, you know, you see these reels and stuff and like I get, I always get like a little discouraged because I want them to be like best quality. So yeah. like, I have a bunch of reels, but I'm like, nah, I hate that, that little part about it. It doesn't look legit enough for me. Or, like, so like, that's what I'm doing now. Just trying to get the, you know, the, the enough uh, content to just push. So that's like, definitely don't nitpick thing. yourself when it, yeah. when it comes to that. Cause the new algorithm on Instagram, you got is, is consistency. Yeah. It's yeah. not high quality. You okay, know what I mean? Yeah. It's all about consistency. Mm-hmm. Just fucking, that's why I post literally yeah. all the time. And yeah, then I'll have a video that grown, goes dude, it. yeah. stupid. It's awesome. Yeah. It's just all about consistency. What that's about you? That's the biggest thing. Oh, yeah. It's been viral a couple of times. So <laughs> you guys are, once a couple of times. It's embarrassing, bro. <laughs> post Malone hates me. Yeah, huh? that, that one was huge. Yeah. That one was stupid huge, bro. But see, that's the thing is it took, um, like, fuck, we'll say it took like 600 videos that flopped to get that's that crazy. one. That's how it goes. That's what's crazy. All yeah. the time. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. it's just consistency and shit like that. That's just yeah. huge. Yeah. Per se. Uh, were you finished yours? Yeah, yeah. I think that's pretty much what for my goals, like for the next year or so. That's what I'm trying to focus on right now. Yeah, yeah. no, hell yeah, yeah, dude. What about you, dog? Man, I'm just living in the moment right now. Uh, Straight vibing. I got <laughs> yeah. to say, uh, I'm working with Steph. I try to be more consistent. That's like the goal that I have on my mind all the time pretty much right now. It's just, so I work manual. Over. I get home every day and I'm, Beat, yeah, yeah, straight up. Yeah. I'm lucky I can do stuff on my phone, honestly. <laughs> yeah. Dude, which is crazy, too, because now we have phones where we can do it. You got to remember all the people like back in the day, Biggie, Tupac, all that yeah, era, that bro. Shit, yeah. They didn't have no yeah, social trying media. trying to get on the radio. Oh, that, yes, yeah. But it's way more oversaturated now. Oh, yeah. It's harder. It was. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Exactly. It's so easy to make music now. Mm-hmm. I know. It's so accessible. Everyone's doing it now. Yeah. It's definitely yeah. saturated. That's a good word for it. Mm-hmm. But that's your... Do you just kind of yeah. just I don't be more like, consistent? I don't, and then, like, long term, I would love to be able to make this my full-time career. Yeah. And live off it. That's my end goal always. Always, yeah. But then again, I also want to make music that helps people. Like, music helps me. Yeah. I want to... Um, I just want to enjoy performing. And yeah. Music. Exactly. Yeah. Really yeah. 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 yeah, I'll tell you right fucking now. Don't get that mindset. I don't want to be yeah, famous. I'm not famous yeah. at all right now, and I absolutely love what's happening with my music. I love yeah. doing these shows, even if it's a small one. Like, I love meeting new people. It's all about the hometown the love shit too. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So like that feels better than having a bunch of fans yeah, when you have like when you guys had G Force and everybody came out every mm-hmm. time. You know yeah. what I mean? Just, yeah, yeah, that was one huge. Concert in my hometown. Yeah, not a lot of people showed up. Yeah. <laughs> That's how it goes. Yeah. Though, That's how it goes. It's, 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 you'll have small, 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 and then you'll have a big one, and then it'll go small again until fucking all of a sudden you're ice spice and you just blow up out of fucking nowhere. Because <laughs> yeah. Drake wants to eat your ass. I don't know. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Shout out Drake. Yeah. <laughs> <Thanks>. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yeah. holy shit. Well, that's good. It sounds like you guys got a fucking. You guys overall have a fucking game plan for it, shit. That's, like, obviously the biggest thing. Yeah. 
That's dope. You guys came on logically. That's dope. We've no, been talking about you guys coming you guys, on for yeah. a while now. Yeah, big What's time. Fuck? Yeah. I appreciate you guys coming on too. Yeah. You guys are phenomenal. <laughs> I was man. very nervous about you guys coming on, yeah. but I'm very happy. Was you guys you? did. Yeah. Well, I always get nervous. You get yeah. nervous? Yeah. You think I just walk in here with my dick just flopping around? Yeah. Like, <laughs> just full of confidence all the time, nonstop, yeah. every day? Right? No. Yeah. Sometimes I'm like, fuck, man. Yeah. It's like stepping in cold water. Your shit shrinks a little. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? It's like sometimes I come in here and I'm insecure as fuck. Dude. I am. <laughs> sure. Holy shit. I mean, for fucking... Um, <laughs> you can't stop swearing. I can't, dude. It's, I think it's because I'm sweating so bad. I just, it's a cry for help or something. Um, I'm here for you. Jesus. If you keep touching me, I'm going to have to have sex with you and you're not going to like it. It's going to smell keep like raw that, cheese. But last time as we all saw, you're going to be my power bottom. As I was you know, I was just telling them before you got here too. I was like, we make so many sus jokes that people probably think something. Oh, probably. <laughs> <laughs> And her name's Craig. <laughs> 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 Shit, well yo, appreciate you guys coming yo, on. Is there anything you guys want to say or get off your get off your chest before we fucking Let's hear it? Got like four or five, maybe six song EP coming out soon with nobody. I saw that. I almost asked you about that. I talked to nobody before yeah. you got here. I had to shout that out real quick. Yeah. You guys announced the name yet? We don't have it. We don't have even all the songs completely together. We don't have the, like the idea or like the brand or the image or anything figured out yet. So it's being made. It's yeah. What about you, what's your next release? Have you talked about it yet? Have you yeah. announced it? I got no. I'm about to like this week though. I got a song coming out called uh, "Up All Night" featuring my boy Grizz. So uh, yeah, that's. I haven't set a date yet or nothing, but you, I'm gonna just post reels and I'll, I'll release one. Where can the people yeah. find you guys both? Shout out your instas. Uh, my- Yeah, yeah. Uh, VV Steph underscore underscore. I had to use two because they had the name taken already. <laughs> yeah, but, hell yeah, yeah. But uh, that's my Instagram, and then Spotify, VV Steph. Every all platforms, VV Steph. So yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Yeah. Well, yo, thanks for coming on. It's yeah, been a vibe. Yeah. I've had a lot of fun today. Me too. <laughs> Even though I'm sweating and I'm I probably got some that, swamp yeah. ass <laughs> right now. Yo, that couch is the worst. Yeah, it's hot. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. I don't know how you do it on that couch. Oh, because and the sun is yeah. beating on my neck. I have yeah. a sunburn now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the life, bro. Yeah. <laughs> shit alright well huh yeah dude fucking little spoon <laughs> pop out shit <laughs> <laughs>